From salon and gym workers who need a test or anyone who just wants one, Onondaga County is offering thousands of them per day. The new locations added every week. News Channel Line's Andrew Donovan takes us into the Emergency Operations Center, where the testing is literally mapped out. You can see a couple of them have dotted yellows, which means they were yellow zone schools. With all of the technology available in the Emergency but Operations Center, example, Deputy one County one Executive Ann Rooney shows us the whiteboard where the testing plan is laid out week by week. You ready? Nice and gentle, okay? We've seen what the testing operation looks like on site, but this is where it starts. The county has made it a priority to keep schools open, which requires burdensome testing. Students and staff in orange zone schools are tested regularly. Buildings in the yellow zone get a lot of testing at first before being cleared. So we know in this instance, Team 4 can accomplish three schools in that day, and we look on the map and see how close they are, how much time they need in between each. Next week, the county's eight testing teams will be available at different fire departments, village and town halls, senior centers, parks, and as always, the on center. It's for people not showing symptoms and not exposed, but who want peace of mind, they're not an asymptomatic carrier. We've seen that some people may not go to the location that we set up, so bringing that location to them gets us into another pocket of testing and opens that up. The work is worth it and will be worth more. This organization system is laying the groundwork for a more complex vaccination plan. In Syracuse, Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9. And you can check your nearest testing site if you're looking for a test. It's hours of operation and sign up with the county if you go to localsyr.com.